Holly on Mischief Maker likes to call Old Man Story. We're going to cover a few different topics. Uh, we're going to talk about uh, how I came about building a teardrop trailer. We're also going to talk about bison and why I have a Cross Timbers bison shirt on. And if there are any uh, bison producers in western Nebraska that we could come visit when we get the trailer done, just give me a shout out. I'd sure like to go out and view your operation. And also to Holly on Mischief Maker, uh, you said you like turtles and old men stories, so this is an old man story for you. And the last subject will be on uh, the condition of my heart health and why I'm feeling better these days. Good evening, uh, fellow do-it-yourselfers. I was gonna do a uh, video on what I had completed, but I didn't get much completed, so uh, going back to, I watched a video from uh, mischief maker Holly, who is a bad, uh, shall we say, tough lady who does uh, four-wheeling over uh, rock trails. And she said that she's, uh, she used to be a opera singer, but she's now uh, does rock crawling all around the country. And she said that she had two things she, she loved. One were turtles and the other were uh, stories from old men. So I'm an old man and I'm gonna tell you a story today. We're gonna go back six years until uh, when we started this project, just before I retired, my son and I built two trailer frames. I was going to be the, uh, the new teardrop trailer builder, but then uh, about a year in, I had a heart attack, which slowed me up for a year and a half, and I'd already bought uh, most of the major supplies for two trailers, all the axles, wheels, had the frames built, had the plywood, had eight sheets of aluminum, and uh, I was going to whip out a couple of teardrops. Well, come to about uh, four years later, I finally got back on the project. Then I had another little hiccup with my heart and had uh, more stents put in. That slowed me up, but uh, and we got back on the build and I started making videos to motivate me to to uh, keep on task. So slowly but surely, we've been uh, making progress. I've made a few mistakes and I always share those so other people who are doing their builds have a little mistake here and there, don't get discouraged. I always say we do it right because we do it twice. And as far as my motivation i remember back when i was in my teens seeing a, a a article on how to build a teardrop trailer in in popular mechanics magazine so later on i going through trailers on the internet and i saw on quaffle press they had uh, the eight foot cubby teardrop uh, plans to build so i ordered that and then I, after i uh, got started I noticed they had the the 10 foot Comet available so I ordered those prints and uh, I started that build and as some of you who have followed me know that I don't always follow the plans uh, I'll just wing it sometimes sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't but this is the point we're at right now and over here is uh, the hay bike that I got, I've got to thinking that, you know, I want to go around to the parks. Originally, my plan was to travel the United States after I retired in my teardrop trailer, but I've scaled those back uh, now. I just want to discover my home state in Nebraska, explore the nooks and crannies that uh, all the neat places to go kind of stay off the roads and in the small towns and as you see I'm 
I'm sporting the uh, Cross Timbers Bison t-shirt. One of my interests is I uh, love to see the bison. I've seen them up at uh, Niobrara State Park and I'd like to make a trip back up there. And another thing I decided that I'm getting pretty old and can't uh, walk a whole lot so I decided to get uh, an electric bike and I got the hay bike here which I think is going to be perfect for uh, riding around the parks and and different places uh, when we're out exploring. Uh, I have had it out uh, to our little trip up to Wayne this fall for one day and uh, unfortunately uh, there was a tragedy there and uh, the event got canceled so we just had the afternoon of a short ride or two. And on uh, another note, uh, with my heart condition, I've just been given a, a change in medication. Uh, the cardiologist uh, had me quit using metropolol and he gave me two other medications. It has really changed the way that I feel physically. I feel a lot more energy and I think I'll be able to speed up this build a little bit more. So if any of you out there have heart trouble and taking metropitol, uh, I'm not a doctor and I'm not giving advice, but this is what I'm taking and I'll, I'll put it in the, uh, in the text because I don't really remember the medical names of these prescriptions. Well, uh, hope you people uh, enjoyed the story instead of the build. We'll get back to the build next week. And uh, sorry I'm a day late because I've recorded all this thing earlier today. And uh, in the heat of the afternoon, my iPhone quit working. And uh, I had video but no audio. So thanks again for watching. Uh, our next video will list the names uh, that we have of the people who are enrolled for the drawing on the free t-shirt. So please comment and you can get your name on there too. We're up to 241 subscribers, so nine more and we're gonna have the t-shirt drawing for the giveaway and then you choose which t-shirt you want and the t-shirts will be shown uh, at the end of this video. Thank you very much. Please like and share. And uh, thank you for watching. And ring that bell for notifications on when the next video comes out.